What we had to do was to create a, a solution to keep the vials stable. And so we put together a, an acrylic tray that could go into the existing boxes and it enabled the workers at the health authority to count out the right number of vials, put them into the tray and send them to remote communities as quickly as possible. So this tray was designed to be able to ship reduced quantities of vaccines throughout the province. We found acrylic to be a suitable candidate. Uh, so we did create blanks out of cut acrylic rods and then also proposed uh, building a tray to be able to ship reduced quantities in an easier uh, method than juggling little rounds. Our initial prototype held 143. We reduced it to 100 because that's closer to the volumes that they might need to ship. And we've uh, also uh, divided it into uh, rows of five to make them easier to count at a glance. Uh, we definitely had to be mindful of the tolerances in the box. We didn't want to in introduce any jostling or shaking when they're trying to open and close the box. And we also needed to make sure that when the material got cold and shrunk, that it wouldn't actually get so tight that it would pinch the vials. I think the end product is pretty great. It's uh, been a, a series of changes and iterations to get to this point, but I think we've come up with the most cost-effective and rapid solution that we could. Uh, the reception has been quite phenomenal. Uh, they were stating that they do have issues loading it in time because they are limited to three minutes. Uh, so we proposed to also developing a grabbing tool to be able to pick up five vials at a time and load the tray uh, much more rapidly. We're very proud of the work that this team has done. Uh, not only were they able to respond, I think, very well to the needs uh, expressed by the community, but we were able to do so in an almost phenomenal turnaround time. Uh, to have a request on Wednesday morning and to have something ready for delivery by Friday is, is pretty amazing. We're essentially the research and development outfit for all small and medium-sized enterprises in the Lower Island and really throughout BC um, for companies that don't have their own R&D facilities.